Hello, this is Mark Van de Wettering of the BrainWagon blog at BrainWagon.org. Um, this is my implementation of a Pong clock, an idea that, uh, gosh, what's his name? Can't think of his name now. Uh, you can check the posting associated with this. Uh, invented. Uh, the idea is that you, the score at the top keeps track of the clock, which is uh, actually I just reset it so it's zero, zero, and six minutes. And um, this sort of plays Pong automatically. And when the minutes need to increment, the person at the other side loses. Come on, you know you want to. It's getting up there. Oh, and it increments to seven. And so this will actually keep time on the clock. This is actually running on a cartridge that I burned myself on my Atari. 2600 that I still have lying around, one of two. And let's see if I can get this jittered around. Yep, there it is. Running on the cartridge. Um, you can actually adjust the time with some joysticks. I haven't got any here today, so I haven't not gonna do that. And uh, let's see, what other massively fun features does it have? It has uh, the ability to play in black and white or in color. So, I programmed this using the Stella emulator, which is awesome. Uh, I can't explain to you why you should want to do stuff, although it is kind of a relaxing and fun hacker activity. Uh, sort of like doing crossword puzzles or Sudoku. You, uh, the hardware is sort of weird and you have to research a bit to figure out exactly how it all works. But this is uh, one of my latest little tinkering projects. And it's good to uh, see it working. Uh, thanks to Brendan uh, for loaning me his ancient PC, which is the only thing that uh, I could find that uh, had a parallel port, which I needed to <laughs> run my EEPROM burner, which I hadn't run in five years. But uh, <laughs> uh, thanks again, and I hope you enjoyed it.